Hi everyone, this is Aaron, and this is my first Anchor podcast. Anchor.fm is a website, and Anchor is an app that records audio and formats it into a podcast. Now, traditionally, with other podcasting services, you had to sync it up with iTunes, you had to put in a lot of metadata. But with Anchor, the cool thing is that it does all of that for you. The interface is very much like an app, um, very graphical, and uh, I wanted to try it out. Um, I want to do this podcast for a couple reasons. The first reason is because I just wanted to experiment with it just to see what I can do. I wanted to see what the possibilities are, what the features are, and if it really delivers on what it promises. So far, so good. I've been playing with the features and I've uploaded a couple test episodes and I've liked what I've seen. I think there's a lot of features that I'm not going to be using, such as interlude music, although that might be fun to play with. There's also uh, the ability to do interviews, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be doing that with that. I'm not sure if I'm going to be using that, but this is, this is fun. Um, so yeah, that's the first reason. The second reason is because I want to improve my communication skills. I am currently teaching 11th grade Sunday school at church, and I know that my communication skills are not the best, at least my verbal communication skills. Um, I do like to write, but for Sunday school teaching, I want to improve how I verbally communicate. Now, I know that teaching isn't only verbal. I know that there's a lot of physical and non-physical cues that people can play into, but I do want to polish this verbal part. A lot of that means slowing down how I talk, and a lot of that means using my tone for emphasis using volume when I get louder or when I get softer. And I want to eliminate my verbal tics, like saying, um, and whatever else, what other, whatever other type of filler words that I have. So I'm not, I'm not a perfect communicator. I think that maybe this practice might help me. I guess it depends on how mindful I want to be about what I'm doing. But I know that when I do communicate the essential points and the main points of my lessons, I do tend to focus closer. Uh, Yeah, I tend to focus more closely on my words and the way I'm delivering it. And so hopefully this podcast is a nice way to work that out. Uh, The third reason why I wanted to start this podcast is just for fun. Just for fun. Um, I'm currently hosting some other podcasts and Every time I've done a podcast, it's been with someone else, whether it's been with someone from church or with Jess. Um, So I wanted to try to do something where it was just me talking into the microphone to see what that's like and just to have some fun experimenting with this. Uh, So yeah, those are the three reasons why I want to try this Anchor.fm podcast. It is available in Google Play. My preferred podcast player is Overcast, and I believe it will be out on iTunes soon. I'm also planning to release the episodes on YouTube. You can listen to them and also watch the transcription go through, thanks to Anchor.fm, at youtube.com backslash music. My website is musicgoon.com, and you can find everything that I do online there. Thanks for listening. See you soon.